Now, I have to admit that sometime before this movie was made, I was given a copy of the script to read in case I was interested in writing some additional material for it. I read it and thought that apart from a couple of really rather good speeches, there was very little of interest in it for me. The characters seemed dull and stereotyped, and the plot used as a thread on which to hang overdrawn character portraits, each character being used to represent a comment about society. The union official, the policeman, the militant extremist, the bourgeois middleman, etc. A comment expressed with the kind of heavy-handedness one would expect at a political party's Christmas pantomime. But I was wrong not to take into account the director. Lindsay Anderson has almost completely turned a piece of adolescent political fervour into an interesting and sometimes very funny parable. Wake up and do something about the world. All the characters are self-seeking, unfortunately true to life this, and even the professor of surgery played by the brilliant Graham Crowden, who has a way of saving the world by increasing its brain power, is more than prepared to kill to achieve his aims. When you watch this tape, just listen to the speech he makes after he quietens down the rioting rabble at this hospital of life. A more subtle script with a more oblique approach might have preached less to the converted, but I couldn't have wanted better or more exciting direction. So this movie, which disappointingly few people saw when it was released in Britain, but which is rapidly on its way to becoming a cult movie in the States, is a well worthwhile video. Let's have some more Lindsay. And now, after all that seriousness, I would like to squawk. <coughs> Thanks, Graham. Thank you.